Welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon to stay updated with the latest in entertainment news. Today, we're diving into the latest developments in the case of Young Dolph's alleged killers. Almost three years after the tragic death of the beloved rapper, the trial date has been pushed back once again. Let's break down what's happening. Young Dolph, whose real name was Adolph Thornton Jr., was tragically killed in November 2021. The incident took place in Memphis when two men got out of a stolen Mercedes Benz and fired several shots into a bakery, tragically ending Dolph's life. This heartbreaking event was captured on CCTV, leaving fans and loved ones in shock and grief. Let's talk about the key points in the trial against Justin Johnson and Cornelia Smith, the two men accused of his murder. The trial was originally set to begin in March of this year, but has faced multiple delays. Now, the new trial date is set for September 23rd. The first point to understand is the reason behind these delays. Both the prosecution and the defense have requested continuances to prepare their witnesses for court. Shelby County Judge Jennifer J. Mitchell granted this motion. Although she expressed her frustration over the delays, she emphasized her desire to see this case resolved promptly, but acknowledged the need for thorough preparation. I was really anxious to get this case over and done with starting this week, but they both expressed to the court the desire to get experts in. So I allowed the continuance to occur. The second key point involves additional suspects. Two other men have also been charged in connection with Young Dolph's murder. Jamarcus Johnson has pleaded guilty to three counts of serving as an accessory after the fact, but has not yet been sentenced. Another suspect, Hernandez Govin, is accused of ordering the killing, a charge he denies, and he is currently awaiting a trial date. These additional charges add more complexity to the case and further explain why the trial has faced so many delays. Lastly, let's address the frustration felt by Young Dolph's partner, Mia J. She has been vocal about her dissatisfaction with how the case has been handled, highlighting the lack of communication and the prolonged process. Last year, she shared her feelings with Rolling Stone, expressing the emotional toll this has taken on her and Dolph's loved ones. I'm fed up. It's been two years worth of conspiracies, two years worth of unknowing, two years worth of people not properly communicating to you. Her frustration only grew when she found out through the media, not the authorities, that the original judge was removed by the Tennessee Appeals Court. This lack of direct communication has been incredibly challenging for Dolph's family and fans alike. As we wait for the trial to begin in September, our thoughts remain with young Dolph's family, friends, and fans. We'll continue to follow this story closely and provide you with updates as they come in. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content from the Red Carpet Reup.